Gerbigly! Hey there guys and gals, it's Gerbigly with another episode of Gaming with Gerbigly. And at the moment it's like 5.30 in the morning or something like that. This is probably going to be another Tired Beagly episode because I'm, I'm really not with it at all. My brain is totally gone at the moment. I'm very tired. I'm probably going to go to bed right after I'm done recording this. This is a game called Kirby.exe, as you probably saw from the title of the actual video, uh, which makes sense since you're watching it on my channel at the moment. Anyway, so Kirby.exe, also known as Kirby's World, apparently, according to the file, because it's a spooky, scary, spooky, spoopy spaghetti pasta game. Um, and, uh, it, I guess it's based off of a creepypasta or something like that. I have no freaking clue. Creepypastas, I, they're, most of them are wasted on me. I get the point, like, I love scary stories, but it, all these .exe games, most of them just suck. Um, this one, from everything I've seen in the comments, isn't that great, uh, which is kind of why I'm playing it as a Tired Beagly episode, as opposed to an actual, like, ooh, it's so spooky scary but uh, I guess we'll go ahead and we'll get started. It says arrow keys move around the darkness and run away from them. Space, interact with notes, and them. And shift is a jumpy jumps. It's all your fault. You did this, didn't you? Oh, cool. I can actually move the... Look at this. I can move the arrow keys. I can move the the, 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 font, the placeholder. Um, it's all your fault. You did this, didn't you? Now you're next. Don't worry. They'll get you lots of dots eventually. All right, what do I what do I hit to go? What do I get what the hell? What do I hit to go? Awesome start to the game so far. All right, um, I might have to exit out and oh, okay. If you hit escape, apparently you get a Y Kirby. That starts the game. You can't escape the game. Look out, guys! It's all your fault. Question mark. Question mark. <gasps> it's a spooky, spooky, scary. Oh my God! Look at this walk cycle, though. I love Kirby games. I played a whole lot of them when I was a kid. This is, uh, man, I can't, this isn't a Kirby game, I can't float, it's not a Kirby game, I can't suck, I gotta suck stuff, I'm gonna suck you, oh my god, you're a great Kirby with the bloody eyes, and the blue feet. this is your fault, blah 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 blah, okay, what's my fault, you got bloody eyes, and you got blue feet. it had to be done, he had to do it, who had to do it, what, what's being done, oh, hi, sniff, sniff, what, 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 what are you? You just leave me alone. Okay. All right. Bye. <laughs> that was that was easy to do. He was just a kid. Why? Why? I don't know. What are you talking about? We'll get you. Okay. Well, you're doing a poor job of it. I'm walking right by you every time. I'm right here. Run back. Okay. See ya. I'm running back. I love this walk cycle though. Look at. Looks like Kirby has. He's got crazy clown feet. Just got clown feet, and he's kicking himself in the face over and over. Push, push, push. Uh, I'm Kirby. Beep, boop, beep, boop, beep, boop, beep. I love Kirby's Dreamland. Um, it's like it was like my first. I'm pretty sure that was my first Game Boy game on the original Game Boy, and I was like boss at it. I could like speed run that shit. Maybe I'll do that for the channel sometime. That game was really really fun for me. <laughs> okay, you sad cry baby. All right, so what's this? It's really weird too that jump is shift. I feel like I'm really happy I turned off sticky keys like a long time ago because otherwise I'd get that message. It's like your keys are all sticky, bruh. So does it say exit or evil? Evil exit. Maybe that's what it says. Ooh, spooky doopies. All right, dear King of Dreamland, King of Dreamland, wouldn't that be King D D D? I don't know. I would like to make a request. I'd like the menace dead. Please respond back. Thank you sincerely. Part of the letter is ripped off. <gasps> Who could kill Kirby? Who would want to do that? Who would leave a note and then sign their name and have it ripped off? Why? Why so serious? So is that why King DDD wants you dead in all those games? Is because uh, someone sent him to kill Kirby from beyond the grave? You just don't get it, do you? I don't know. Oh, that Mario door noise. <laughs> I love it. It's like that freaking bit crushed fart sound, pretty much like. <laughs> you touch us and you're d -d doomed. Okay. Whoa. It's a platformer all of a sudden. It's a real Kirby game. Hi, buddy. What do you have to say? Oh. You think you can escape? It's all your fault, you menace. I just noticed that up in, in the top left corner there. 
Some good atmosphere here. Okay, so apparently it starts you over if you touch these guys. Now now they're bad guys. Before they were offering me helpful advice. Whoa. Okay. Ooh. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my gracious. Oh, I see that there. Oh, that's a little trolley thing. It wants me to bounce off that and, and fall into the hole of doom death. Those with pupils of blood red still have forgiveness in the menace. Oh, so so you have forgiveness for me because your eyes are bleedy bleedy? You, you're next. Okay, I'm next for what? You guys are bad at explaining things. You're very cryptic for things that want to kill me. Alright, I hope I don't run into one in the dark and start all the way back because that would be poop butts. Uh, there's gonna be like a jump scare or something. I don't know, these games always have like the jump... Wanna play a gig game of high hide and go to seek? <laughs> I, I'm very curious as to why they stutter? Am I gonna I'm gonna get jump scared any second now, I know it. I know how you work, game. I I've, I've seen these types of games before. It's gonna be spooky scary, jumpy scary. Ooh, I made it to the door. I'm gonna win now. The door is locked. But what's that? You hear a noise behind you, so of course we'll go towards it because we are the bravest Kirby. Oh, hi, buddy. You got the blood red eyes, so you ha technically have forgiveness for me because I'm the menace. What did Kirby do? I, I need to know. I gotta keep playing to find out. Found you. You are lucky some of us still have forgiveness for you. You hear a noise back of where the door was. Well, that's convenient. Okay. Well, that was a very, very lame game of hide-and-go-seek. Whoa, now I have a purple block on me or something. <laughs> The darkness that surrounds you is getting deep. There's no chance of escape, so just go to sleep. Ooh, nice rhyme, man. Dr. Seuss up in this piece. Darkness still up to no good. Corner there. The menace may not disturb the souls of blocks. Of blocks? Seize him at once, Dreamland officials of, of blocks? Excuse me, the blocks have souls now? I guess in like Thomas Was Alone, that game, those blocks had souls. I feel you, man. That's some deep shit. <laughs> it's all too late for you, isn't it? I don't, I don't know, you're the... Oh! Oh, some more Mario noises! Okay, that gave me some light. It says, no! I'm gonna hit it a bunch then. <laughs> you don't tell me what to do, block. Yeah, no, you got a soul, apparently. Thanks for all the souls, though, bruh. Okay, so... Yeah, <laughs> I'm playing a creepypasta.exe game. The first one on the channel. So far, it's got a great impression. Oh no, all my soul light went away. Better keep kicking myself in the face. <laughs> Alright, Curbs. What's gonna happen, man? What's gonna happen to us? I don't know. I'm still up to no good, apparently. <gasps> Tag. You're rich. J -j -j just wait. Wait for what? What am I waiting for? I'm waiting for the bus? I'm waiting for the... The... Next Twilight movie to come out? Oh! Holy shit! Look at... <laughs> look at that... Look at, look at that Kirby! I mean, I, I don't mean to be mean, like... Whatever dev put time into this to, to scare people, I don't want to be a dick to you. At all. I mean, like, you have a great premise here. Like, the, the .exe games have, have a really spooky premise deep down, but, the dude, like, at least, like, steal some stock images from, like, the Nintendo website of Kirby, man, and t invert the colors, I don't know what you want to do, what, the t <laughs> I, I, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, all right, like I said, I'm not trying to insult the dev, dev, I, you're, you did more than I could ever do in a game so far, I just, uh, you know, I'm sorry, I, I'm not getting the spooky vibe, I'm not getting spooked out, do you, 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 you get it now? We told you that. You're next. Okay, well, um, why do you stut- why are you stuttering so- oh. And the game is closed. The game is closed! We won! We won the game! We're so good at Kirby.exe. So, that was the first .exe game on my channel. Um, you guys were a part of it. You saw it. Like I said, I'll probably upload this as a Tired Beagley episode because I'm certainly emotionally exhausted from that. Um, <laughs> but anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this episode, please be sure to hit the like button, share the video, and favorite it. Also, be sure to subscribe to me if you guys haven't already. For those of you who have, thank you so much for all of your support. You guys are the best in the world. I love every single one of you. And as always, it was great seeing you. Bye bye.
randomized already, so it becomes excellent uh, every time you play it. Um, but it is it is way more fun to do it with challenges. It's just it, it gives it this fresh freshness, this unique feel to it. And uh, you know, ah, oh, God, butt's ass. <laughs> ah, you're a dick. You're a dick. Ow, I fell into the spikes because I'm an idiot.